वेलकम बैक टू वीकेंड आई नेम्स गौरव नाम तो सुना होगा ना वेर एवर आई मे हैव ट्रेवल्ड इन द वर्ल्ड वेन आई कम बैक आई फील देर इज नो प्लेस इन द वर्ल्ड लाइक दुबई टू लिव इन यू नो दिस प्लेस रियली एनकरेजेज इनोवेशन एंड देर आम टीन एग्जाम्पल्स फॉर अस टू सी एंड बिलीव दिस नाउ रिसेंटली आई केम अक्रॉस अ कॉन्सेप्ट कॉल्ड राइट now this concept has become very very popular in a very short span of time and i think it's a great concept as well because it's promoting healthy eating habits among the ue residents there's not a soul who doesn't love a mingle at the market the smells the tastes the touch and the feel of delicious fresh produce combined with a chilled out vibe that a giant supermarket could never deliver Welcome to Right. This is where we hold our weekly food and food and craft market. We have lots of local artisans here from honeys, vegetables, um delicious olives. So every Saturday from 9 a.m. we hold this every week at the courtyard in Alcoz. Right is not just a fruit and vegetable marketplace. Now this is a place where you can enjoy some great food made out of some of the best and the freshest ingredients. It's a place to have fun with family and friends and most importantly, this is a place that supports local farmers and other local artisans. So that is right for you. Right is a passionate company with a small but dedicated team handpicked because they love what they do. They aim to promote healthy eating amongst UAE residents by providing easy access to the best and the freshest produce. So as you can see, we've got lots of local fruits and vegetables um that we we get from the farms in the region. Um you can get your local right box or you can get your individual items. So everyone everyone who participates here every week um makes their own items and are very passionate about their brands. I think the market itself is probably one of the best markets that they have in Dubai and I think that Ripe's done amazingly well. I think they've done um a fantastic job in a really short time and I've been coming to the right market since it opened this season. Um I only moved to Dubai in March, so I'm quite new to it, but I come mainly for the fruits and vegetables every week, but I love all the additional stalls. Uh they're so unique and so different to the the big shopping malls in Dubai. But um yeah, so me and the children come every week. It's the first um gluten-free kitchen in the UAE. So we bake for people with intolerances, with celiac, with the gluten intolerance. with egg dairy many intolerances and we're always part of the right market every saturday as well as the right market you can also come to our right shop and um, which is based in Um Sakim um or you can um order online at our um website www.rightme.com from food to art it's actually quite a logical transition because you know art is the aphrodisiac of the soul and dubai has always been a place that has encouraged artists both international and local and so to give the show a truly arty touch we're going to take you to an evening that was full of art an evening that was called the man behind the canvas an intimate account of mf hussein's life through the eyes of his granddaughter a presentation of his prolific work the event showcased the best of mf hussein's work along with a trip down memory lane with his granddaughter sharing some moments that we would have always wanted to know i think it's a great initiative because uh, nothing like this, like this has been done in the past because it's more to do with his personal life and regarding his works and his exhibitions everything is available on the net but here you get to know more about how his life was small instances with his family and uh, there are lots of small stories to tell about his personal life the picasso of india who earned both fame and wrath for his paintings is one of the entities who will always reside in our hearts and minds regarding his style of painting i think it was very diverse he could he had so much knowledge about all kinds of subjects be it the ramayana be it uh, any religion and i think he depicted it in a beautiful manner and uh, the colors on his canvas and they just speak volumes you, even if you're not an art lover and maybe you don't understand art once you look at the canvas uh, you're in love because it's the figures and the colors speak for themselves this evening is significant in couple of respects first of all it is a confluence of the 
two icons of art, of the world of art, from India as well as from Pakistan. The evening also saw the marvelous paintings of Pakistani artist Sadiqain Ahmed Nakwi, best known for his skills as a calligrapher and painter, one of the finest talents of Pakistan. Indeed, it was truly an evening of master art and men behind the canvas who've made the canvas come alive. Art and literature is the identity of a nation. It's not the man-made boundaries, it's not the leaders or diplomats or bureaucrats, but it is the culture and literature and art that defines a nation. And if there are two nations who have a common theme, commonality in their art and literature, that brings them together, it bonds them together. From the man behind the canvas, it's time for this man also to go behind the curtains. Because I'm going to meet you again the next week. Until then, remember to keep your questions, no doubt, no doubt, all the solutions. Weekend out.